a little video introduction thing I was trying to do there. Um, here we have Transformers Cybertron Buzzsaw. Now Buzzsaw resembles um, Transformers Armada Cyclonus. I remember that. I was watching, skipping actually through one of the episodes to find his name. Um, let's see. Uh, I'll get over the things that resembles Buzzsaw in a minute, or, uh, Cyclonus in a minute. Um, he's a Decepticon, he's crazy, he's brave, he stayed on, um, Cybertron. He wants to get the planet's energy on for himself, he wants to destroy the Autobots, and he practices aiming. Here's his little bio standards. Like I said before, pausing can be good. Oh, it's just gonna be blurry. Overall, pretty good. Um, real fast things that resemble Cyclonus are, uh, let's see, the, the head kind of resembles him. Um, we have these which resembles him. And then just the whole body resembles him a lot. Uh, you can flip this up, and there's a little gear mechanism in there. Which sort of little thing is this thing supposed to click when you press the propeller button back and forth like a gun? Doesn't really work, I don't think. Anyways, that's just to me. Um, the head wants to go in there a lot, but there's his head. Um, he needs to come with two, two cyber keys. He comes with just the Decepticon symbol. I have another one. Now, why I say he needs to come with two is so that way he can get some macho power going. And when you stick it in here, it shoots out. Now, these things can shoot actually pretty far. Uh -huh. Beep, beep. Yeah, the first one shot farther. So... Here, his missile. Here's the right arm missile. As far as I know of. Anyways, it's the right arm missile. Stick it here, and then the left arm missile. So there are two different missiles, actually. Which that's a really nice touch. Um, has just fist. Uh, for trans. How to transform this fellow is you first want to take the arms and. Push it into there. Take this arm. Push it up. So it looks like this. Um. Well, actually, I'll say the articulation. That would be smart, wouldn't it? Articulation before transformation. <laughs> I rhyme. So this can move up. This can move. You know that already. Uh, the waist can rotate 360 degrees around. Legs move out to here. And these can bend. They kind of walk right here, so they're a little bit harder to bend. Um, back to transformation. Transform them by folding the arms up like I had already said. And then we... What do we do next? Fold these feet out. Turn his waist around 180 degrees. Fold this out like this. Then unhinge the knees. There we go. And there we have Cyclone I'm mean, Buzzsaw. Um the legs don't really stay in that well, which is kinda pitiful on the company's part. Which the company is Hasbro. I'm snapping that in there. But here's a side view of them with the nice button right here. You can kind of see guns going in and out. Uh, this thing can, these can fold down to be more guns. Um, main color scheme is a little greenish sun stricken yellow, um, darker colored gray, lighter colored gray, um, darker colored red, um, some darker colored purple, and then a little bit of a forest greenish color. So, kind of nice. These things can move however you want them. I like them folded inward. 
I don't know why. He also has a jet on the back, so that's good. Um, the, the, the figure, like I said, they based it off of Energon and Marta figure, which they have done twice so far as I know of. Um, so, really nice figure, actually. Uh, I kind of don't like him because the legs don't like to stay, but that's all cool. Uh, if you watch Transformers Armada Episode 9, he reaches his arms out like that, and so he can reach his arms out and pick up little kids. Um, I do have to say, though, if you do want an Armada-looking figure, this is the rap to go. His, his um, Decepticon symbol is right here. Um, pretty nice-looking, actually. I mean, he does look nice for an Armada figure, but I don't know why they decided to change him into Cybertron. So, I would recommend this figure for more so um, sitting on a shelf and being modeled. Yeah, that's my review. Uh, music by August Burns Red. Uh, copyright goes to them. It's...